Hey guys, it's Kendall. It's me, Kalani. It's Chloe. So great to have the team together. Ah! Here we come, naked. Yeah, but today we're gonna, you know, go above and beyond, right? Uh, yeah. Oh shit! Oh shit! For the first time, Nia is on top of the pyramid. I am absolutely ecstatic. Hey guys, it's Nia Sue, and in honor of National Body Confidence Day, I'm excited to be kicking off 17 and Instagram's Perfectly Me campaign. This is a space where we can celebrate our bodies. Right, more butt, it's all about the butt. I act now, I'm on a soap opera called The Bold and the Beautiful. Yes, yes. Yes, right. so I do that. I'm still continuing with my singing. I'm still continuing yeah. growing as a dancer and taking classes. Okay. I don't compete anymore, but taking yeah. classes and doing it for my soul. And I think Mia has a lot of ability and talent. Oh shit, oh <laughs> you know what? I want her in an afro. Oh shit! Oh shit! You woke up in the morning with Abby in your bed. Oh yeah, that happened. Do what Miss Abby, Abby does best. What the heck is this? I was like, okay. This is my daughter, Chloe, who is nine. Yes, I am. <laughs> oh my gosh, my voice. Sometimes I just don't want to dance. I mean, I love dance. I just am tired and I need a break. I took a break. I started acting. Um, I wrote a book. I was doing school. And then I'm really proud that I got to have all those, like, well, I'm really grateful that I had all, all those opportunities. Thank you very much, Chloe. Mother's going to ruin her. It's obvious. I make funny moves. Nobody's perfect. old and I've been dancing at Abby's for about four years. For me to be a part of it, I was so excited. Peyton, you finally have a place. These are my two daughters. This is Paige, she's 10, and Brooke is 13. Hi guys, so I'm back, and as you can see, my room looks completely different. Um, I just wanted to give you guys a tour. I like always thought I was gonna be a professional dancer, and then the show happened, and I kind of realized that like, that's not the industry I wanted to be in. I'm trying to like manage being a college student mm -hmm. while also being an inspiration to like younger girls and guys, I guess. Like, does it matter to you that you're not getting first and second anymore. Not really. Is your little sister going to college too? Cool. And she still dances? She does not. No.
Oh, showing off your sexy little bod. Inappropriate. Well, I'm getting a boob job. Talk to the hand, because I don't care. Candy apples! My mom danced, my grandma danced, so Ivy has to dance. I think you like dance. Five, six, seven, eight, get it up. two daughters, Maddie and Mackenzie. Maddie's eight and Mackenzie's six, and they're both dancers. Maddie, make a shot. Woo! Oh! I'm a perfectionist. <laughs> hey, everyone, it's Maddie. Why do you sound so sad? Hey, everyone! My hair looks so weird. Uh, that's not the Maddie face I know. The Maddie that's jumping and warming up, trying to psych Chloe out. I'm an expert at the Maddie face. Now remember, you are undefeated. People are out to get you. Oh shit! Oh shit! Come and fly away with me. Come and fly away with me. Come and fly away with me. Come, come and fly away with me. Don't you be afraid. Everything will change you and me. Cake, we just want to eat her up. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make fun of me. The whole point of this video is to make fun of you, but. Oh shit! Oh shit! I don't want to go on Broadway. All I want to do is just stay home and eat chips. Mackenzie, can't sit on the couch and eat chips. Why? Okay, this is actually a funny one. My first embarrassing memory was when I did a recital with my dance studio and I peed my pants on stage. And I was five, I, I'm pretty sure. It was literally the worst thing ever, and everyone uh, laughed at me, but good thing they forgot about it like a week later. I'm a weirdo, weirdo, weirdo. <laughs> you are benched. And obviously I was like the biggest crybaby. Don't cry. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> Mom does not see this. <laughs> if I had one feature of yours, what would it be? Not my nose, that's for sure. <laughs> New lips, and I said your whole face, because you're perfect. Ah, uh -huh, funny. You're perfect. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and it said, if you could marry any fictional character, who would it be? Troy Bolton. He's just been my celebrity crush since I was five years old, no biggie. 
Shut up. Go. Okay, what's yours? I think my first like celebrity crush was Justin Bieber because I'm literally 14 and I don't know what love is. So. She got the time to love me. Lord, I love you when you call me sugar daddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs>